IHCN Studios. It's Braves Beat. Hello, Braves, and welcome to our latest episode of Braves Beat. I'm Katie Green. And I'm Miles Wilson. So, Katie, what are your thoughts on your last fall homecoming of your life? You know, Miles, to be honest, time has gone by super fast. I remember when I was a little freshman. <laughs> Let's save that story for later. <laughs> Meanwhile, we've got some news to catch you guys up on. September 15th through October 15th is Hispanic Heritage Month. We would like to recognize Desi Arnaz, a Cuban immigrant and entertainer who gained fame from starring in the I Love Lucy TV show in the 1950s. He and his wife, Lucille Ball, created the Desilu Production Company. Congratulations to all of our amazing Hispanic Americans. Are you looking for volunteer hours but don't want to sit inside? Sign up to work for the Camargo Hunter Horse Trials on September 30th, October 1st, and October 2nd. If interested, email Mrs. Mendoza or Dot Douse. Next up, we want to send congratulations to the Braves Marching Band for winning Best Music Performance in second place in Class A at Taylor Invitational. The National Merit Scholarship Corporation recognizes 19 Indian Hill High School students. Seven of our Braves were named semifinalists in the 2023 competition. Congratulations to the students pictured here. Additionally, 12 of these students were recognized as National Merit Commended Scholars. A big shout out goes to Katie Giannis Deal, who is recognized as National Hispanic Scholar. Way to go, Scholar Braves. Braves, are you interested in paid internships, professional development workshops, competitions, hackathons, cyber conferences, and more, then be sure to join the Indian Hill Cyber Club. Reach out to Reese Tuttle for more information. Time to get into our sports news. Let's see what happened this week. What's cracking, Braves Nation? I'm Zach Rosenbaum. And I'm Sam Huell. We got a lot of sports to cover, so let's jump right in like a rat into a deep fryer. On Thursday of last week, our volleyball of Braves crushed Deer Park 3-0. Tomorrow they will play Colerain at home at 11 a.m., so make sure to give them a good luck. Last Wednesday, senior Piper Isgrig shot 40 against Marymont and became a medalist. She is currently number one in the CHL. Great job, Piper. Last Wednesday, the girls' soccer team fell short to Taylor. This Wednesday, they played Madeira, and we will have those results next week. Tomorrow, they take on Tippecanoe at noon, so be sure to fill those stands at Shawnee Field. Last Thursday, the boys' soccer team demolished CHL rival Taylor 3 to nothing with goals by sophomore Connor Wilkes, junior Gavin Johnson, and senior Mitch Ford. Later that week on Saturday, they fought hard against Seven Hills and tied 2-2 to -two with two goals by Wilkes. This week on Tuesday, they demolished Madeira 4 to nothing with goals by sophomore Aiden Faber, sophomore Connor Wilkes, and junior Gavin Johnson, and senior Sam Halsinger. Spicy senior Victor Consolino came into the game for 12 minutes and 42 seconds. Tomorrow, the boys will travel up to Alter for a game. Good luck, Braves. Last Wednesday was Braves Senior Night, celebrating Hannah Pollock, Sarika Singh, and Yamini Balaji as the girls' tennis team crushed Madeira 5-0 to earn the CHL title for the 26th year in a row. On Monday of this week, they played SUA Varsity and won 3-2. Then on Tuesday, they swept SUA Varsity 5-0. Wow, that's some great tennis. On Monday, the girls compete in round 16 of the OHSAA State Tournament at home at 4 p.m. Our cross-country team ran last Saturday at Troy. The Varsity boys placed fifth. Senior Liam Morris led the way, finishing in ninth place. He ran a 15.56, which is just one second off the school 5K record. Wow, that's really fast. Way to work, Braves. Last Saturday, the field hockey team took on Hilliard Lynx with another win, 4-3. On Tuesday, they came out on top of Fairmont with a score of 3-1 with goals by sophomore Charlotte Condorotis, sophomore Lauren Eckert, and sophomore Samantha Kane. The ladies take on Allen Taney with tomorrow at 9.30 at home. Two weeks ago, senior Sarah Vanaski made an outstanding state save against St. Ursula that helped us win the game with a score of 1-0 by the end. Last Friday, our Braves lost a barn burner to the Warriors of Marymont after a late score put the Braves down 16-13. The Braves had explosive flashes on offense, however, including a beautifully executed trick play resulting in a C.J. Hayden to Noah Frazier touchdown. This Friday, our dogmen faced Taylor at home. Be sure to come out and show your support. The theme will be country versus country club. 
on Tuesday, the Birdie Braves competed at the CHL Championship, crushing the competition in a first place finish with a 295. The Braves were led by Wyatt Higgins and Alex Hosoffel, but both shooting a two under 69. The Braves are back in action this Sunday in the Best of West tournament. Good luck, Braves. Well, that does it for this week's sports report. Let's see what the Lynx drag back in to Miles and Katie. Get them gains, Braves. Introducing the EDU podcast by Superintendent Konecki, where stu Indian Hills students have an authentic conversation. Episode 1 stars seniors Sarka Singh and Jonah Waltz. Let's take a look. Hi, I'm Kirk Konecki, Superintendent of Indian Hill, and we are here today for our first Edgy Hero podcast, taking student voice nationwide. And this, and this is, is the Student, student Perspective. perspective. Wow, interesting commentary, Jonah and Sarka. Here's a reminder that next week is Homecoming Spirit Week. Here are the themes for each day. Roll the clip! Don't be afraid to go all out and make sure to participate. Everyone make sure to sign up for the Warrior Run. The event is at Dogwood Park. You can even participate virtually if you prefer. Don't delay. Be sure to register while it's still available. Check the link in the description. Dylan and Devin had some interesting interactions with some of the students. Let's check it out. Hey guys, this is Dylan Minocha and Devin West. You know, we're going to be embarrassing ourselves on Braves Beat. Thank you for watching. Join Literary Magazine Club. What are you guys doing? Uh, what's your name? Can I have your snap? Please? Please? Hey man, I'm trying to find like a homecoming date. Like what should I like do to ask someone? Like what should I like say? You're asking the wrong guy? I have no idea. Okay, that's fair. Hey, keep your head up, King. Ah! Ah! Oh my God. Can I have your snap? Uh, watershed! <laughs> yeah. My oh bad. My God, wait, can I have your snap? What? Can I have your snap? Hey! Hey! <laughs> that was invigorating. Speaking of homecoming, are you asking anyone? Well, Miles, you just have to wait and find out. Well, that's all, folks. So be sure to follow us on Twitter and Instagram, subscribe to us on YouTube, and email us with any school updates. And remember, stay, stay classy, classy, Indian, Indian Hill. Hill.